All right, so here is the uh, the breech block from my uh, TCR Tipman TCR, and uh, I had issues like many other people with the first strike rounds breaking when I first got my Tipman. So what I did was I found on the internet, I found a Glenn from Trolls of Doom um, had a forum post where he talked about polishing and, and sanding or sanding and polishing out the breech. So I said I'll give it a try, and sure enough, when I pulled out my breech, I looked at it, the milling was horrible. Now you can't tell it now on this, but it was very, very rough all the way around through here and the back side. It's just very rough all the way around. Not only that, when I took out my breech and I took a first strike round, and I was trying to drop it, drop a first strike round through the breech, you know, kind of like it would happen as the magazine would load the first strike round, I noticed it would get hung up. And you can see I can kind of get it hung up there a little bit. But before I modified my breech, if you got it just the, barely the wrong angle, it would get hung up and get hung up pretty bad too. So what I ended up doing was I uh, had my breech out like this and actually started uh, sanding it out and trying to get off all the rough edges. Now I actually took a grinding wheel. Let me see if I can pull that grinding wheel out. My breech entrance seemed very... <laughs> it seemed very small. It almost seemed too small. So even with sanding, it was going to be a really tight fit for first strike rounds. So what I did was I actually took a grinding stone. This is, uh, I don't know exactly what attachment this is, but it's basically something for the Dremel tool. And I was able to grind this out. I did it very slowly and carefully to just remove a few millimeters of material. Now you could do it with sandpaper. It just take you longer. But I took a grinding this grinding wheel and slowly grinded this out um, until I could get where the first strike round fit about in there with just a tiny 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 bit of space around it okay and then I took sandpaper this is a 220 grit started with it and ripped off little pieces of it and just used my finger to smooth it out there okay and I did that for a while and then I took a thousand grit and ripped off a very small piece that I could put around my finger and then continue to sand and get it really smooth. Then I finished that up with um, using a cleaning and polishing kit. This is like a one of those um, polishing brushes. You know, it's got like a felt tip on it, I guess. And I use some polishing compound. This is actually a, what I got, the Dremel cleaning. I've had this for a while for other things. But I just finished it off by polishing all this out, you know, putting some polishing compound on there and just buffing it really good to where now when you fill it, it's very, very, very smooth. And as you can see, I mean, my first strike round still just barely fits in there, but it's just perfect. And I can get it hung if you can see that it, it's hung up in there. But if you barely tap it, it falls right in because it's so smooth. Um, and since I've done this, so I'll tell you, before I did this, I was breaking about, on average, one first strike per 10 rounds. Okay, so it wasn't consistent. It wasn't like I was breaking them like crazy. Uh, now, sometimes I'd break two first strikes uh, in a 10 round magazine. Sometimes I'd go through a whole 10 round magazine without any breaks. But obviously, you know, breaking any. And the bad problem is you break them in the breach. Because what happens is they get halfway up in there and then the bolt slams forward and uh, just shatters it. And some people even get their bolt stuck when that happens because parts of these fins get stuck in there and just bind the bolt up so it can't return. But either way, re regardless, when you have something break in your breech, you really almost have to take your breech out and clean it. I, I put mine in some really, really hot water, almost boiling water, to clean it out. Because uh, trying to clean your breech without taking it out of the gun, you can do it. It's just, it's hard to get everything out. And then also your bolt's all slimed still. So anyways, but I will tell you, since I've done this polishing job, uh, grinding and sanding and polishing, I went through, I've gone through over a hundred first strikes, not a single break, not a single problem. And also, uh, the last game I was at just this past weekend, that's when I went through a hundred first strikes and um, I was mixing back and forth. I went through a hundred first strikes and more than a hundred balls, probably, I don't know, probably two, three hundred regular paint balls I've shot through this with, with no problems at all. So it only takes a few minutes to take it out, do the sanding and polishing, and makes a world of difference. Thanks, guys.